so listen, hey, the next week you're wrestling Tony Falk, but first you're going to cut another promo, and we have that for you. This is my Maybe favorite. The only promos I cut in Power Pro. Dude, this is like turning into my favorite episode ever. Here we go. Match coming up with Kurt Angle. Oh, there's the cat. Here. We uh, saw him first last week, and uh, he's going to be in action here today. He was out to... Here comes your music. It sounds like the Smurfs horn. Last week, and uh, here he comes. He, he said he wanted another uh, word. Well, okay, I guess you can. And uh, here he is right here. Kirk, welcome back. Uh, I know we uh, talked to you a little bit last week, and uh, you wanted to uh, say some <laughs> things to the fans. First of all, it feels great to be down here in Tennessee on the Power Pro circuit. And I'll tell you, I'm really excited about today's match. The first match last week went really well for me. I, en I ended up with a win feel really good about that, but after watching the videotape last week, I realized I was a very cocky jerk, and that had a lot to do with the guys back in the locker room telling me that I don't belong here, that I should stick with the amateur ranks. And you know, winning the Olympic gold medal was the greatest experience of my life, but I want to do the same here in the pro ranks. I want to win the world championship, and I'll do whatever I have to do, and I know the only key to that is good old-fashioned hard work. Very good, Kurt. Well, I know with that kind of attitude, you're going to have the fans behind you. And I think a lot of championship wrestlers will tell you there's nothing like having that great fan support as you go in the ring. No doubt about it. No doubt about it. I'm very excited to have the fans behind me. I'm ready for today's match, and I want to get another win under my belt. Well, we got a match uh, scheduled for you here today. Now, Tony Falk is going to be in. Tony has uh, asked for this match with you. He said he's got something to prove. He's got something to prove to Brandon Baxter and uh, and some other folks. So here's your opponent right here, Tony Falk. He he uh, he said he's been uh, he's been wrestling for 20 years, and uh, you know he says you're the kid. Yeah, you won the Olympic gold medal in '96, but he's not uh, he's not really sure that uh, you're as good as you say. But I think the fans may disagree. Well, I know that he has a lot of experience under his belt, but. You know, I do have a, uh, I'm a lot younger, I'm more prepared, I think I'm ready for this match, I'm very confident I'm going to get the win. Very good, nothing like confidence, Kurt, good luck to you. Head in there and let's see what happens against Tony Falk. So Kurt, I got to ask, who's oh. helping you with your, with your gear at this point? Because we went from Stone Cold to now a Chippendales dancer, apparently, so... <laughs> Me and my manager, Dave Hawk, that was about it. I should have had somebody uh, helping me out with it, but, uh, you know, I I just... Now, I didn't know if you were going to oil your... Well, I, actually, this was camouflage. This is my camouflage singlet. This was your camo with the little, hey, I'm still going to le leave my chest and nipples exposed. Just strap them in so they look nice, and I don't know what we're doing. But here you go, 